So, Kenny, how do you even begin to describe that? Yeah, first off, I thought it was a great advert for League One football generally. Uh, in terms of the game, they deserved their um, their lead at half-time. Um, looked a harsh free kick uh, against us, and then it was a deflection. But, but Sunderland were better than us up to 45 minutes. But from 45 minutes on, I thought it was all us, including extra time. And uh, we had the better chances, we had more of it, and we deserved to win. You know, McGeady's a big player and got two key goals for them when we we looked like we were in control but you know, fair play to the players they you know kept going uh, showed a lot of perseverance to come back in the you know, start of the second half and put on such a, a dominant performance uh, from then on and then after that you know five uh, five out of five excellent penalties which is really good and a key save from from Craig which in the end ultimately has made the difference. And as you say, Sunderland were the better side for a while and then Pompey came back into it. That says a lot about this team and, and the spirit that the squad have, doesn't it? Yeah, it needed it. And, you know, if you're looking at our season, we've got, you know, it's a 60 game season plus any playoff games if we're there. Uh, so, so for us, you need to find different ways of winning. We've talked about winning the big games. You know, we think we can be consistent and, you know, we're always there in terms of uh, the games but you know it's a big game today and, and a very unique and one-off occasion and I'm pleased to say we came back well and uh, deserved to win the game in the end. And one would assume that you already had your takers selected before the game but what do you as a manager say to the squad as you go into penalties? Yeah it's a big one and it's very very important uh, uh, don't change your mind yeah, it's a, it's a really big thing it's the best advice you can give anybody at that moment you know when you're stepping up in front of 84, 85,000 people. Uh, uh, you have to then get in a mindset where you know what you're doing and, and then trust your technique, which is important. And, and, and we did, you know, really pleased. Obviously, we know uh, Gareth can take penalties, uh, uh, Brett Pittman, Jamal's very confident. Lee Brown always is when we're talking about or, you know, selecting penalty takers, but he's, he's unfortunately down the list, uh, but took a key one. Uh, and then after those four who, who regularly speak up, you know, I always think it's best to go with forwards because they're used to putting the ball in the net. And uh, for Ollie anyway, it was a terrific fifth penalty. And Ollie Hawkins, he certainly didn't change his mind. What a moment for him in terms of his journey. Yeah, big one. And, um, you know, such a key one. And, and as I said, you know, you look to you look to your forwards who are used to scoring and, and practice scoring all of the time. And, um, you know, f four out of our five uh, were, were boys that uh, are, are and do work at the top end of the pitch. And 40, in front of 40,000 Portsmouth fans as well, what does that say about this club? Yeah, we, we really do appreciate the backing when it's um, uh, sold out as quickly as it, as, it, as it was. You know, we haven't been to Wembley for nine years and it really did whet, it whet the appetite, which is great. And then, you know, kicking into them second half was a... Was, was, was a really big one and um, they got right behind us and you know fantastic scenes at the end you know very proud ones uh, shows the, the potential of a fantastic club and just finally you've achieved so much as a manager but in terms of memorable days where does this one rank yeah it's a unique one definitely and, and it is the most important one because it's the latest one it is here today and you know when you're seeing two such big clubs uh, playing today with, with such an attendance and so, in the end a fantastic atmosphere. You know, it's the most important one because it's, uh, it's, it's the latest one.